This week in cross-cultural communication, we looked at the topic of trust. Uh, trust is a critical aspect of day-to-day -day life, and it play, plays a large role in the public relations field. For example, if a company can instill a sense of trust, it can help a company gain a favourable reputation among its publics. Likewise, it can damage reputation and make it very, very difficult for a company to make any business dealings if they do in fact lack the trust of their publics. In society, we place our trust in various different places. Uh, these can be classified within personal and public contexts. These include putting our trusts in family, uh, doctors, firefighters, our politicians and other occupations like that. Um, the Edelman Trust Barometer which we looked at in class, is an idea that measures attitudes and uh, predicts trends regarding trust within businesses, uh, government, um, NGOs and many other industries. Um, following on from this, we looked at the five C's of trust, which are character, confidence, uh, competence, uh, credibility and consistency. These can all be related to a PR context. Um, Grunig and Hunt, in their 1998 text, say that the link between trust and PR deals with uh, the extent to which management and publics explore willingness to make themselves vulnerable to each other, and the confidence that um, a party then instills in its own decision-making and other companies' decision-making. Trust plays a large role in influencing people and influencing uh, perception. Uh, this can be an advantage, namely for consumption. Uh, for example, Apple. Apple instill great trust in their publics, um, and this means that people will come back and buy products each time a new one is released. Um, this is the challenge for multinational organisations because their audience is just so large that to instill um, trust, it's just so broad. Uh, trust is a key responsibility uh, for any communication methods and can play a large role in many areas of public relations as we've looked at this week, including consumption, crisis management and corporate dealings.